Hi, welcome back to Rebecca's Travels. Or if you're watching my lifestyle channel, welcome back to Rebecca's Lifestyle. Uh, today I'm going to be doing a UK travel news latest COVID-19. The rules. So let's jump right into it. Now, according to news.sky.com, the latest um, information uh, by the UK government is uh, basically what you have to do coming back from an another country to the UK. So let's fire away with the UK government have been implemented fresh travel restrictions after taking advice from officials in Australia. From next week, new UK border measures will come into force as ministers act to prevent the possible import of COVID variants. The new measures from the 15th of February, that's next Monday, UK and Irish residents arriving in England who have been in a, a red list country in the previous 10 days will need to quarantine in a hotel room for 10 days on arrival as soon as they arrive in the UK. Uh, they will have to book an online through a dedicated portal in advance and pay for a quarantine package which includes assigned transport to their hotel, COVID testing, food and drinks. The charge for a single adult will be £1,750 and the government has booked 4,600 rooms across 16 hotels. Fines from 500 to 10,000 will be issued to arrivals who fail to quarantine in a designated hotel. Passenger location forms which are required for presentation at the UK border will now also have the passengers travel journey but also their quarantine and testing package. They are 33 countries unfortunately are on the red list and these are Angola, Argentina, Bolivia, Botswana, Brazil, Burundi, Cape Verde, Chile, Colombia, Democratic Republic of Congo, Ecuador, S. Fantine, French, Guinea, Guyana, Lesotho, excuse my pronunciation, Malawi, Mauritius, Mozambique, Ni Ambia or Nibia, Panama, Paraguay, Peru, Portugal, Rwanda, Seychelles, South Africa, Suriname, Tanzania, United Arab Emirates, Uruguay, Venezuela, Zambia and Zimbabwe. Anyone um, attempting to conceal that they have travelled in a red listed country could face up to 10,000 in fine or prosecution and up to 10 years imprisonment. It's not worth doing so. Again, if you've been to a red listed country, then you will have to uh, pay the hotel pa package, get tested with a negative test and quarantine for up to 10 days. Um, if you are not arriving in England from a country that is on the UK red travel list, you will have to still quarantine, but you don't have to quarantine in a hotel room. However, 
you will still have to complete a quarantine period at home for 10 days. Currently, any, everyone arriving in the UK has to show proof of a negative COVID test, regardless where you've come from, results uh, from up to 70. You would have to produce a negative COVID test as a result from up to 72 hours before your journey home. So I would like to say thank you for watching and um, Tomorrow I'm going to be uh, doing a my travel and lifestyle channel updates, improvements and more tomorrow. So please keep watching and it will be uploaded about tw at 12 o'clock noontime GMTV. So please keep watching. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel my channel if you haven't already done so i hope you have a fab fabulous day today and night and see you tomorrow thank you bye